I really love this product because even though I'm oily skin, you know, it keeps my makeup intact. Preview. This is Aliana Dolida, also known as It's A or A here on YouTube. I'm a beauty and lifestyle vlogger and today I'm gonna show you my everyday makeup routine. So I actually have an acne prone and oily skin so my makeup will be as simple as it gets. A neutral eyeshadow, a pink blush and lippy that will get me through the rest of the day. So the first thing that I like to do before putting on my makeup is to use a moisturizer and I'll be using this CeraVe Daily Moisturizing Lotion. Don't forget to bring it down to your necks. So I'm just gonna let this dry for a while before um, moving on to the next step. The next thing is I put on my sunscreen and I will never not talk about the importance of sunscreen because it really helps in protecting your skin especially if you're always on the go. So I'll be using this Dermaction Plus by Watson's Aqua Gel. And this is one of my holy grail because it's not heavy on the skin, it easily absorbs, and it doesn't have any white cast. And lastly, it makes my skin bright and dewy. I really like this because it doesn't feel like I'm putting anything on my face. It's really lightweight. There, you can see my face looks bright and dewy because of the sunscreen. For my base, I don't usually use foundation because it really feels heavy on the skin. So I typically go for CC cream or tinted sunscreen. So I've been using this for months and this is the Snail White CC Cream and I really love this product. So try this one if you want to go for that glass and glowy skin. So the next thing that I like to do is my brows and I'll be using this Face Shop Designing Eyebrow Pencil in the shade Black Brown. So I've been using this product since I was in high school. When I'm doing my brows, I really like to focus on the middle portion to the tail of my eyebrows to make it more natural. There, I like to do a line first underneath and I just brush it. There. That's how fast I do my brows. So next is I'll be setting my face and I'll be using this Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. I'm gonna be using a beauty blender to apply it. Um, I like the way my makeup sets when I use a beauty blender as compared to when I'm using a makeup brush. I just put a little on the cap. Then I take my beauty blender and start putting it on my face. I really love this product because even though I'm oily skin, you know, it keeps my makeup intact. So next is I'll be bronzing my face and I'll use this Kula Bronzer from Benefit. So as you can see, I have a round face so bronzing helps me make it look more slim. So I'll be using this brush to apply my bronzer and I apply it here. And I blend it upwards to make it look lifted. You can see the difference. My face looks more slim. And I also love using this bronzer to add a little wash of color to my eyes. I'll be using this. Now that's done, I'll be putting on some highlighter but only on the inner corners of my eyes. So I really love doing that to make my eyes look more alive. So I'll be using this Colorette highlighter in the shade Crystal Prism. And I'll be using this brush to apply it to the inner corners of my eyes. Next is blush. So I really love cream blushes and I use this Easy & Co Cream Blush in the shade 
for real. So this one is like a dark rosy shade. Before, I used to apply my blush with a makeup brush. But then, I tried the technique of my friend Marcos, which is to use a beauty blender because it sits on my skin more evenly and you can build it up depending on how you want your blush to look. I'm just gonna use this beauty blender and apply it here. Just above where I put my bronzer. There. And I also love putting my blush on my nose just to make it seem that I went to the beach or like I sunbathed. Let's move on to lips. I'll be using this lip tint from The Body Shop in the shade Pink Hibiscus. I really like to just pat it on my lips. To add a little oomph, I'll use this lip oil from Clarins in the shade Red Berry. This one's really nice. I really like the color and it smells so good. It smells like candy. There. So this is the final look for my everyday makeup. I hope you picked up a thing or two. So thank you so much Preview for joining me as I put on my makeup. See you again next time!